The reason credit scores exist is to give lenders an idea of how likely it will be that you'll default on a loan. The higher your score, the better. Conversely, the lower the score, the greater chance you will default on a loan. Lenders use this information to decide whether or not to give you a loan and what interest rate to charge you. But what criteria do credit reporting agencies use to determine your credit score? I'm Sean Ryan of Blue Coast Realty and let's look at how credit scores are calculated. First, the credit reporting agencies are going to take a look at your payment history. This criteria makes up around 35% of the criteria they're going to look at. Your payment history is your report card on what you've done with loans that lenders have extended to date. They will look at credit cards, mortgage loans for any properties you own, lines of credits, installment loans, car loans, and even your school loans and many others. Next, they'll look at how much credit you've used versus your credit limit. This is referred to your credit utilization ratio and it counts for around 30% of the criteria. It's important to keep this number low because it shows that you're not maxing out your credit cards or lines of credits and it shows responsible use. Another thing they will look at is how long your credit accounts have been open. And this accounts for around 15% of the criteria. Older accounts that were used and not abused show reliability over time. You can see why mortgage lenders want to know this information. They are providing you with a pretty hefty amount of money, so they need to know your track record. Recent accounts are going to be looked at too. And if you're opening a bunch in a short time frame, that raises red flags sometimes. Next, the mix is public records, which is about 10% of your credit score criteria. Anyone who's gone to say bankrupt or had difficulties with debt collection or other negative public records may be rated as high risk. These type of events can cause your credit score to take a huge hit. Finally, there are inquiries or hard polls on your credit file and they count for another 10% of your credit score criteria. So you could personally check your credit score and credit file without harming your numbers. Only inquiries that are related to active credit seekers will impact your credit score. So if you want to get your credit score, don't hesitate. I hope you liked the video and have a better idea now of how your credit score is calculated. Thanks for watching and welcome home to the Blue Coast.